The latest exhibition at Wuglaku's Studio and Garage is a collection of large and small scale drawings and paintings by local artists James Ratliff and William Denton Ray. Ratliff and Ray met after both were separately featured in an Indianapolis star story about the rise of a specific genre of modern art. The pair practice what's often called lowbrow art or pop surrealism, and their joint show, High Pop, at once embraces and resists those labels. I was looking through the other artists and I knew Emma and actually Rob Day contacted me and we kind of chatted through email and I noticed James' stuff but I didn't know James. We're both graphic designers by day and then we're kind of like these phantoms by night. You know, both of our work is fairly unconventional. It's not what you'd generally consider fine art or uh, some people probably wouldn't consider art at all. I remember my mom bought me a series of books on uh, like UFOs and Bigfoot and uh, Loch Ness Monster and all these things. And I just read them over and over and over. And uh, I just always had that like fascination for those sorts of things that you know more than likely are not real, but they're still fun to think about. As far as painters, I look at Basquiat a lot. Um, and then, you know, Ed Big Daddy Roth was one of my first inspirations. My dad had the magazine, you know, and I looked at it forever. And it, it really inspired me to kind of create these kind of figures and monsters and... I, I like them to feel awkward, you know, slightly dark, but completely harmless at the same time. And, um... Is that a reflection of the person creating them? I don't know. Maybe so. <laughs> I'm sure they're... I'm very specific about these, these drawings that come out. They're, they look very loose and almost childish. I just kind of attack the canvas or the board or the plywood. Uh, I just kind of go at it and let it be natural. I don't take it too seriously, and I try to forget what I learned in art school. High Pop opens on Friday, March 6th, with a reception from 6 to 9 p.m., and after that it runs until March 26th by appointment only.